You've been involved in the camp before, um, what's it like this time around? A few new faces, but a few familiar ones as well. Yeah, mate, we've got a really good mix, uh, especially some older, experienced players that, that played in previous World Cups, but then the younger fellas that have come in as well that, that have set the Super League alight. So, uh, you know, it's a really good mix and, yeah, the camp's really good. It's, you know, pretty, pretty standard. We all, we all get them really well and uh, we're all having a good, good time, really. In terms of the, the intensity and the, the training, uh, it's been tough but enjoyable? Yeah, yeah, a mix of both and you know, we've got to enjoy our time here and enjoy uh, working hard together and uh, we know the intensity that it's going to take to, to get to where we want to be so you know, the intensity and our standards are, are massive when we're out there training and when we're in the gym and stuff like that. But then out of it, just making sure that we enjoy each other's company as well, which is important. And uh, you know, we've had a bit of a... 13 on 13 today, a tough session, and uh, a few lads from Wigan and Warrington's academy come in to, to, to make up the numbers and to really make a difference on the field. Um, what's it been like for them and, and for you guys to go up against them as well and good experience for them? Yeah, really good experience for them and it gives them an opportunity to, to train with uh, some of the best players and you know they'll, they'll gain experience and learn from that really well and uh, you know that's full credit to them. You know, we really appreciate and really grateful for, for them coming in, you know, in their time off to to uh, help us train and help us prepare for Samoa, which is which is massive for us uh, leading on to this weekend. You touched on Samoa there, you know, everyone's talking about Samoa, but talked about earlier the, the strength and the depth we've got in our squad and, um, you know, we must be relishing that, that massive occasion on Saturday. Yeah, it's massive, you know, it's a, it's a huge challenge for us. Uh, like I say, you know, the media and stuff like that, speaking about the other teams and big on, big on Samoa as well, but for us, we've just got to focus on ourselves, you know, the team that we've got, the squad that we've got more than capable of winning the tournament so uh, for us it's getting ourselves prepared as best as possible and uh, you know looking forward to a, a massive event on Saturday and grabbing it with both hands I think it's a it's a big game for us but something that we'll relish and uh, take on the board. So it's about a massive event you know it will be exactly that and you've played at Magic Weekend before you've, you've played on the big stage and uh, but what an occasion it'll be in a home World Cup to kick things off in, in front of a packed house. Yeah, it'll be massive and the support will be, will be huge for us in, in, in terms of that. And you know, Newcastle is a fantastic stadium, it's a fantastic city. Uh, looking forward to seeing everybody there and you know, looking forward to, to playing in front of a, a really big crowd and, and getting the, the start of the World Cup uh, with, in, in a positive note and going for the win.